Hello everyone and welcome once again to Studio 44 where today we are putting MLB aside for just a few minutes and we're going to play some Dusty Diamonds All-Star Softball. That's right, we're going back to 1989 or back to 1990 and we are going to play some old school Nintendo Entertainment System. I fell in love with this game the first time I played it when I was a kid. I think one of the things that drew me to this game was the fact that you can play in different fields for once. In the old school Nintendo games like Baseball Stars, Bases Loaded, even though, you know, way back to the original baseball game where the Ricky Davis League was created, you played on one stadium every single game. This game has six different fields, and you have to win a game in five of those fields to move on and play the Amazons. They are a team made all of women and they are nasty. They can hit, they can pitch, they can steal bases, they can field. They're really tough. The first five games, usually not much of a problem, but get into that sixth game to win the tournament or the season, whatever you want to call it, super hard. It's tough to do in the first try out, but I have put together the team, I think, that gives you the best shot at winning. So first you have to pick if you're a slow pitch or fast pitch. I always go fast pitch. And here I usually pick the island to get it out of the way because I don't like that field. But let's start in a field where we hit a lot of home runs and a lot of action happens. Once we pick the field, they give you the local rules for that field. This is one of those fields that has some quirks. There's a home run line, as you can see in rule number one. If you hit the ball over that line and someone runs it down and catches it, you're out. It don't matter. But if you hit the ball past that line on the ground, you can run to your heart's desire. And it's easier for some players than it is for others in this game. Trust me on that one. Don't want to be running too long with Diablo in this game. But that boy can hit. All right, so we've seen the rules. Now we have to pick our players. And normally we do this old school playground style. I pick computer picks. I pick computer picks. But I tend to cheat. I want my boys. I want my guys. I need my Clarks and my Mikes and my Mikeys and my Diablos. So I try to pick them really fast before the computer can get to his. And I try to put them in the order in which they're going to hit so I can save a step later on. So here we go. Start things off with Clark, then Mikey, then Leon, Mike, Diablo, Don. Whoops, nope. Alan, Lewis, Sparky. Then we go back up for Don on the bench. And that's my squad, folks. I always call myself the nerds. Very sorry to my nephew, Jaden. I know he doesn't like that word. <laughs> that's an inside joke from our podcast that will be coming to YouTube very soon. Be on the lookout for that. My brother and my nephew. Clark likes to play left. He can run. He can jump and rob home runs. Decent arm. Mikey. Instructions say, the instruction booklet from way back in the day, says he can't field, but he can throw and he's fast. So I put him in center field to keep guys at first base. Leon plays third, Mike plays first. Diablo, who is slow AF, will play center, or I'm sorry, catcher. Stan is my shortstop. Allen pitches, Lewis plays second, Sparky plays right. Don usually comes in to spell Allen. And we start things off with Clark here in the sand lot. This has some uh, quirks. If you can see that rock out in right center field, that rock will get in your way if you're trying to throw the ball in. Mikey finds a hole, and that's going to roll past the home run fence, or the home run line, and into the tall grass. That's going to be an easy inside the park home run for Mikey here in the first inning. Okay, before I time back into this game, can someone tell me what's going on with their hair? Is that supposed to be a batting helmet and it's some kind of logo or something? It looks like a squid or an octopus or a pink banana peel or something. I have no idea what that thing is. Leon is going to go into home run territory and have himself a triple. He can't run like Michael, Mikey. 
So with one out, we got to run around third and our best power hitter coming to the plate. When we were kids, my brother was always better at batting, or er, better at games than me, as we see Mike show off his power, hitting his first home run of this season. Two outs in the first. Three runs have already scored. That ball is caught. Good start here. Allen. Oh, Lewis. What the heck happened there, buddy? So you got to be careful with those rocks out there. You try to throw the ball in, it'll hit those rocks. Fly ball in the center. Mikey goes back over the home run line and makes the catch. Might have had a shot at doubling him off, too, if I was awake over there. Mikey makes the catch. And we're out of the first inning pretty clean. Here comes Sparky. Sparky has a funky name. Sparky Knackle Drag <laughs> is his name. He's got that cannon out in right field. As he strikes out for out number one. Here's Clark. Instruction booklet says he's better off batting down in the lineup. Big clutch hitter with guys on base, but I'm just so used to him leading off. And now here's Mikey showing off some power as he blasts one over those tree stumps out there. That is Mikey's second home run of the game. His first one being inside the park. And that's going to be it for Biff. We're going to see Jose come into this ball game to face Leon, another big hitter. All around, he's got some pop, too. That might be another triple for him. I think he hit a triple his first time up. And that brings up Mike, who has a two-run home run under his belt today. And strikes out. Here's Johnny. I don't do a very good Jack Nicholson impression. Arnie strikes out looking for out number two. Hit that rock. Yeah. That rock can do you favors too sometimes. Mikey barely has to move for out number three. Four nothing, heading into the third. Diablo leads things off, swinging and missing. Popping one up. Easy play for the center fielder, and there's one away. Stan lines one down the first baseline. He's going to have himself a triple. This guy's batting seventh, but he can uh, he can get really hot. Start blasting home runs. Stay fit. Oh, nice diving play. Leon's going to have himself hung up, but makes it back to third. Here's Lewis with two men out, and that's the inning. First inning where there is no run scored. So far, no errors from Mike. Mikey. Mike is my first baseman. Mike O'Malley. Mikey Montr M Montross. Motross? Montross. Mike the Rock, <laughs> apparently. Sparky leads things off with a double at least. Oh, it's going into that tall grass. Now the center fielder has to come over to help out. And Sparky has himself a triple. Taking us back to the top of the lineup, and Clark, who lines one into left field for a base hit of his own. Clark's got wheels. That's going to be an inside the park home run, ladies and gentlemen. Weak tapper back to the pitcher for out number two. Here comes Mike. Has a home run already today. This one is caught. Bouncer to Lewis. Fires over to Mike for the first out. That'll bring up Jose, who's pitching right now. 
He grounds one back to Lewis for out number two. Yeah, this game goes fast enough. I'll try to edit out some boring stuff, but we're more than halfway through. Diablo, weak ground ball. Could run the ball over to first and get Diablo, his slow ass. Here's Stan. Stan has a hit today. Grounds one here to Slash for out number two. Allen trying to help himself. Can't do it. Out number three. That ball just may get out of here. That looks like it was right on the line. I don't know what the rule is for that. I know fair foul if it hits the line, it's it's fair. But home run line, I don't know what the rule is on that. Uh, might not be a home run, uh, but it goes over. <laughs> Speaking of that voice, Larry's up. Oh, Mikey can't get a hold of that one for back-to-back -back home runs. Six to two ball game. Here at the bottom of the fourth, I believe, right? Nope, the fifth. All right. I think that'll do it for Allen next inning. Lewis leads things off with a weak ground at a first. Bringing up Sparky and left-handed against right-handed pitchers. I don't know. I'll have to try to pay attention. Out number two. Back to the top. Clark grounds out. It's a one, two, three inning. Let's just bring Don in for Allen. Don can pitch. Don't have to mess with the rest of the fielders. High fly ball on the left. Clark goes back. He leaps. He can't make the play. What do they name themselves? Oh, the guys. Here's a ground ball to Stan. Fires over to Mike for out number one. Welcome to the game, Don. By the way, his name is Don Swanson. He was made up long before the character Ron Swanson. He likes to eat steak and eggs and bacon. All breakfast foods are his favorite. Don't have me eating the food that my food eats. Sky high fly. That was Leon. Mikey drives one deep into center field. Way back, but caught over the home run line. Yeah. Is it me? I don't know. We'll have to see. We'll have to try to pay attention. Does that home run line look deeper or more shallow, I should say, than an actual fence in this game? Like from the cliff or a professional or... The island. There goes another solo shot. Man. Maybe I should have Stan come in and finish things out. No, not if that's out number two. If he gives up a big fly here, we'll, we'll switch it up. Mikey can often throw guys out from center field on the ground. Ground ball. Back to Don over to first for the ball game there it is folks game number one in the books got a little interesting there at the end but the nerds were able to hang on player of the game has to go to mikey he had two home runs two rbis one in inside the park home run that's dusty diamonds all-star softball that's game one of hopefully only six we will bring the next game to you very soon we'll see you in the next dusty diamonds all-star softball game as always, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please throw me a like and make sure you hit that subscribe button because there's plenty more coming soon.